Well, hello there, and I do hope you're all well. Now, obnoxious Tory MP, Sir Edward Lee, actually proved how loathsome they really are as a party. While also fellow obnoxious Tory MP Theresa Coffey was also patronising the nation about how wonderful this extreme Brexit Tory government were doing for the plebs. I mean, the working class. Up steps prize gammon Sir Edward Lee to basically attack poor, vulnerable people in dinghies. Sir Edward Lee, would the Secretary of State confirm that support for the welfare state depends on a kind of social contract that people realise that people who are pensioners or out of work should be helped because they pay their taxes. How does support for the welfare state, be, how is it improved when 60,000 people a year are pouring across the channel, paying illegal immigrant, uh, smugglers, these are not the poorest of the poor, and being kept on social security maybe for 10 years without ever being deported? And by the way, what does it cost? So to stay. Well, Mr Speaker, um, I'm conscious that uh, through the uh, help uh, uh, the, the, the visa schemes that are being put forward for Ukrainian citizens and for Afghan resettlement. There is accessibility to public funds. Uh, my right honourable friend uh, will be aware, I think, that for people who arrive in the country illegally, uh, they are given a payment via the Home Office, uh, I think, of a, a very a small amount of money in order to pay for day to day, but they are not eligible uh, directly for uh, benefits. There you go. That's all they have left now, isn't it? Dingy spotting. And his rhetoric was nothing more than shameful, wasn't it? But what do you expect from this extreme Brexit Tory government? And I are come back to the Tory, but Tony Ben quote. The way a government treats its refugees is rather instructive, isn't it? Because given half a chance, they would do exactly the same to you all of us. And I found his, you know, rhetoric disgusting. And let's be honest, as a Tory, I think we all agree. He just said the quiet bit out loud, didn't he? I shall leave the video here and until the next time I shall bid you farewell and um, take care.